What's up everyone, this is Zach Has Games. I'm back with part 19 of Super Mario 3D World. And as you can see, we're gonna be taking on this crazy, wacky freaking circus boss. And this guy is like scary. He's actually probably one of the most scariest bosses I faced in a Mario game. Like, I'm, I literally shit you not, I'm not BSing you guys. And like an idiot, I actually forgot something. I really did forget something. And that was to go to the mushroom shop in order to get power-ups. You know, that only literally tells you guys um, that I was actually goofing off right there. But let's do this. This guy's freaking scary. Oh man, this guy's scary. Okay, I guess let's do this. Oh shoot, this guy. I hate this guy, man. I hate him. Oh man. That guy is so freaking creepy. He's like the most creepiest guy in a Nintendo game. Oh man. Oh, what the heck? What the heck? Kill him, let's kill him, let's kill him, let's kill him. Die! Die! Finally, seriously. But I lost two guys trying to kill that guy. Like, was it really worth it? Was it really worth it? I think it was not worth it. I think I should have just like literally halted and just did something else. Okay. Come on. Come on. There we go. There we go, boy. There we go, Luigi. My boy, Luigi. I'm not actually sure, but I think if you jump on a lot of those guys and like try to uh, take them out, this guy will shrink, but I'm not exactly sure. I would actually highly recommend killing this guy instead. Like it's just so much more easy to kill that guy and take his crazy freaking butt out but instead of just like wasting your time trying to do that. I would have had five men, but we only have three because you know those two men, rest in peace, other two Luigis, rest in peace, but there we go. I mean, he's really not a hard boss, but he's just like such a creepy character. And, and excuse me. And if you plan on um taking about, let's say you took about three to four characters, I can definitely guarantee you it's gonna be a very highly chaotic battle there. Like it's really gonna be some crazy stuff if you're going up against this guy. Like seriously, he's probably one of the most creepiest bosses I have faced in a Nintendo game. That's not freaking Legend of Zelda. But other than that, like a beast like that, those crazy monsters from Zelda, I mean, that guy is like really weird. I, I don't really like clowns, you know, I'm not afraid of them, but I never was that big of a fan of clowns, to be honest. Okay, let's do this, and bam. We both got that, um, a thousand points, and we did pretty damn good. Okay, so that boss was literally complete, and we're gonna be moving on to World 7. Definitely not as hard as I thought, but dang. I do not like that guy. I really, really do not like that guy. Knock that place over. That workshop is now out of business, and we never have to go back there again. Ever. Ever. Oh, shit. What? Huh? This is it? Wow. Okay then, this is this is crazy, guys. So I guess this is freaking Bowser's level. Freaking Bowser, I guess we're there, man. We're freaking in Bowser's world. All right, guys, make sure to like and subscribe. Continue watching my stuff. And in part 19, I believe, yeah, part 19, we're gonna be doing, actually part 20, this is part 19. Part 20, we're gonna be taking on Bowser's world. So make sure to have a damn good one. And see you guys later. Peace out.